Okay, question number four. The projectile is launched with a velocity u at an angle theta to the horizontal. So how is it launched? It's been launched like this over here. It's been launched like this over here. This is your initial velocity vector u at an angle theta. Okay. It reaches a maximum height s. It reaches a maximum height s. So this is the maximum height s here. Okay. What is the time taken to reach the maximum height? How much time does it take to reach this height? So how do you do this? So what you do is when it comes here, so what is the y velocity here? y velocity at this point would be 0. Why is it 0? The reason is because if y velocity was there, then definitely the particle would have, projectile would have been able to go upwards further. If it is unable to go here, then the reason is because the y velocity is 0 and its kinetic energy along the y direction is 0. Right? So let us write out an expression for y velocity. Vy is equal to u minus gt. Minus g because acceleration down is downwards. Right? So Vy is equal to 0. Put this u minus gt or t is equal to u by g. Okay, so t is equal to u u y by g. I am sorry, this u y by g, u y by g here. But u y is a component of velocity along the y direction. Now, if this is u here, this side it should be u cos theta and this side it should be u sin theta. Okay, so therefore u y is equal to u sin theta. Now, let me substitute this value here, which should be u sin theta divided by g. So, u sin theta divided by g is given here. Uh, which is the right answer? D is the right answer. Okay.